everyone, this is Stevio here. We just picked up some chicken feed because we don't have no chicken feed yet. We need to get some quick. So we had to go purchase some from the feed store. Oh, that was a rolling stop. Sorry, guys. Squad's truck brakes are a little wore out, let's just say. So we're going to head back, feed the chickens quick. So today, we got to move the cattle. We got to move the cattle to the pasture. So, that creates a lot of things. First, we're going to feed the chickens. Then we're going to go make sure the horses are okay. And we also need to go look at the fence quick before we start hauling cattle. See if it needs any repairs. Park this here quick. There we go. Chickens are fed now. We'll put the other one into the barn quickly. I need to get the. There's a mod that puts this in bags so it's more easy to lift and load. More practical, let's say, than a pallet. There we go. Put that right there for safekeeping. Now let's take the gator here, a little venture. Go look at the cow's fence. We just planted this a day ago. It's looking good. Looks like it started raining on us, so this is going to be a wet adventure here. It's okay, it's a good day to go check the fence. We're just going to have to wear a raincoat. I like this little path right here, it's pretty convenient for the little gator. Go check the cows quickly. So a couple of you guys stated that this cow pasture will not work with uh, a placement mod that doesn't come with already grass inserted so don't know if that's gonna be the case but still gonna use it for the practicality we'll just simulate the other portion because you have to take your cows to the pasture to be able to survive basically having a cow calf operation so this fence definitely looks good definitely uh, is not a normal fence you'd see around a pasture that's for sure maybe an expensive horse pasture Fence looks good. Let's just check all the operations inside. Windmill. Still running. Got a little bit of water in there. It's good. Alright. I think we're ready to go here. Let's hook up to the cattle trailer there. We're gonna get really wet here. There we go. We'll go ahead and check the road before we start heading with all this rain. Rain is just what we needed for the oats crop, but we still need more spring tillage to get done, so I was hoping it would hold off for a couple days or so.
while we're here, we'll go check our crops here quickly. We planted this the other day in the oats. And then the adjacent field also to oats. Look like they're doing good, haven't sprouted yet. Just notice I need to get the seed bags inside. So let's get that quickly before we get in the K10. We'll get, I mean the K30. We'll get in the K10. Back these up quickly. There we go. Oh, I'm having troubles with this. Alright, now that's done. Now we can get to the job at hand. Get into our old K30. Start loading up some cattle. I believe our chute is over here on the other side. Pick up over here. So we can only hold six loads or six head into here. We're going to have to take multiple trips. It's going to be a little hairy going around because of the bumpiness of our roads back to our pasture, but we should be able to make it. This K30 has it in it. go stay away from the road work definitely wish I had a K30 back in the day still wish I had one today it's a good old truck I've always liked the flat look of these this model series of trucks. We had a few work trucks like this. Always nicknamed ours the Silver Bullet because it always kept on running. right here. There we go. There we go. Watch out for the cattle there. And we'll keep hauling these until we are done. This will take quite a while when we're only hauling six head at a time, so we'll make multiple trips back and forth. We ride around in style, sleeves rolled up, glasses on, and then you make that smile and my heart starts racing when I'm with you. thing we're so close to our pasture from a farmyard won't take long though at 
little inside the K30 here with the windshield wipers running. Looks like we bumped a cone over there. All I want is you. You make my world spin round and round. Sometimes I don't know what to do because my heart starts racing. Should be over halfway done now. As you can see here, the gate I forgot to put in earlier is in place. This is a good test to do when the rain keeps you out of the fields. Really getting the hang of driving these roads, driving back and forth so much. Alright, so that was the last cow head we had to get in. We gotta make sure we close the gates. Cow's looking good. Eat all that grass up. It's good. Make babies. Make lots of babies. Take care of your babies. Alright. Now we need to go get our horses take them to pasture we'll probably walk around the their fence while we're going out there because we kind of forgot about it when we had our gator so it did stop raining which is good probably the fields are a little wet still to get in the fields yet Still got some spring wheat to plant and some corn and soybeans. Uh, ooh, I don't know. This might be kind of tricky for the horses. go. All six horses are in there. Horses are easy to haul to their pasture when you only have six of them. Your trailer holds six. Easy peasy. Should be the last load for this spring. It's 
So then we take this side road here. Walk around this fence here quickly. Looks like we did a pretty good job on this fence. Not positive where. Must be right here. There we go. Buddy. There we go. We'll take the truck back now. Should be about done with today's chores. Chickens fed, cows and horses to the pasture. All done. We'll take this trailer over and get it parked here in the shed because we are done with this for a while. Park it over there by the 5488. There we go. So well, now we just got to clean out our barn, two barns here, and that will be it for the day. Thanks for watching this rainy day on Farming Simulator, and I will see you later on Autumn Oaks.